He doesn't look like the baddest man on the planet. But make no mistake about it, I do not believe there's a single heavyweight in the UFC or in mixed martial arts, period, that can hang with Cain Velasquez. Oh, oh, big oh. quick hand. Oh, oh big oh, he's punch. down. He's out. I need to dictate where, where this fight goes. Kane is the next level heavyweight. What he brings to the table, we've never seen before out of any of the previous heavyweight champions. After this fight with Big Fire, I'm gonna have that belt with me again. I'm gonna keep it for a long time. And now Silva's starting to tear. He rocked him. Big uppercut. This is a drop finish of fight. It is a level. It's a big black finish. It's a O princípio tem que estar bem fisicamente, porque ele é um atleta que luta 3, 5 rounds bem. Eu penso nisso todo dia, eu penso no cinturão todos os dias, dando um light, colocando aquele cinturão na minha cintura. E eu acho que o homem é o que pensa. Cain Velasquez will be fighting Antonio Bigfoot Silva for the second time, this time for the belt. Big by Velasquez! I am quicker than, than Bigfoot, so I definitely have to use that to my advantage. I need to dictate where this fight goes. Antonio Bigfoot Silva showed the world with his devastating knockout of Alistair Overeem. After this fight with Bigfoot, I'm gonna you know, have that belt with me again. I'm gonna keep it for a long time. mesmo. <risos> oh, que emoção, cara. Muito mar maravilha. Grande profissional. Eles, esses caras merecem tudo. o que fazem, o que ganham, entendeu? É uma profissão bem árdua, emocionante. I won this fight. I fought uh, over in. I, I knocked me out. And the uh, UFC give him now Cain Velasquez. Just know what he has, you know, what, knowing, knowing what, he, what he's good at. Bigfoot with a lot of hungry. And angry for this fight, for take this belt. I'm gonna do my best. I'm gonna show for the people uh, my best. We're just going in. We're ready, prepared, and um, we're just gonna go out there and you know, just, just, just fight our best. So, UFC fans, we welcome you to the MGM Grand Garden Arena and the official weigh-ins for UFC 160: Velasquez versus Bigfoot 2. Here is Joe Rogan. What's happening, everybody? Welcome to the weigh-ins! Oh, look at that Bigfoot has very big punching power. Wild right hand. He's an enormous man with ferocious intent. Big shots! God help the guy who's in the ring with that dude. I will defeat Antonio Silva, and I'm gonna keep that belt with me for a long time. These are the biggest, scariest, baddest dudes on planet Earth. I'm very ex excited to fight tomorrow. I'm right for this fight. I'm training a lot, and uh, I want to win this belt for sure. This right now means everything to me. Staying here, staying in this position, holding the belt, keeping the belt here. Can't wait to see the fight. Good luck to you, sir. Kane Velasquez, Bigfoot Silva, ladies and gentlemen. E eu vou provar que eles estão errado e você campeão do UFC. I'm going in there thinking this can be a five-round fight, a five-round war. That's what I expect from Bigfoot, and um, by the end of the night, I'll be champion again. We are live inside the MGM Grand Garden Arena. This is UFC 
160. You have a giant man who is hell-bent on revenge, and he's coming off of a devastating knockout victory. But Bigfoot Silva has improved since that fight, has become more comfortable from inside the octagon. The UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Cain Velasquez. That man is the challenger. Bigfoot Silva, who is coming off an impressive win over Alistair Overeem. The champs, Mike Tyson, the Hall of Famer, Chuck, the Iceman Liddell, both here in Las Vegas tonight. The UFC Heavyweight Championship is on the line. There you see the champion, Cain Velasquez. He will face off against Bigfoot Silva again. You know, when you get heads up for a, a final of a tournament, it really comes down to two people, and there's so much riding at stake. It's kind of like you're in the ring, and there's adrenaline, and there's so much to win and fight for, and in a sense, it's really a battle. Antonio Bigfoot Silva challenging tonight for the UFC Heavyweight Championship. Velasquez landed 111 significant strikes and 11 takedowns. <laughs> When you guys do a clean fight, follow my orders all the time, defend yourself all the time. You ready? No problem. Velasquez in the black trunks, looks for the takedown early. Immediately gets a single and Bigfoot got out of it. Velasquez will utilize a lot of movement. Silva pushes forward. The fact that he was able to stuff two takedowns in a row is huge for Silva. Oh, Caught him with a big right hand. hand. Velasquez looking for the That's win. He's out. And it is all over. Bigfoot is protesting, but there's no doubt about it. Perfect timing and the speed of the champion. Bigfoot moved forward and Kane countered brilliantly. Bing, bing. We'll see it again. Bing, bing. Bigfoot moves forward and, and moving forward, Kane nails him twice. One, two, boom, drops to his knee. And then swarms on him. Kane, well, let's go. The important thing was not staying in front of him, moving, you know, looking for the takedowns, looking for the punches, but never staying in front of him. Get on my new Harley. Thank you, Harley. Thank you, Oakland Harley, for hooking me up. Congratulations, sir. Can't wait to see you again. The champion, ladies and gentlemen. Dana, I know you've got a, a lot of key heavyweight fights coming up, but based on how fantastic uh, Junior looked this evening, does that look like that's, you know, the trilogy is next? No brainer. Yeah, if, the, if there was ever a trilogy, that's it right there. If you look at the way that both fights went, Junior destroys him in the first fight, Kane destroys him in the second fight. I can't wait to see the third fight. Dana's already booked your next fight. He said it's going to be the trilogy next. Can you give your thoughts on, on that being the next fight? Is that what you had hoped for and wanted? Um, just that fight made sense, you know. So uh, definitely, you know, um, all up for that fight. You know, throw one or two punches and move or look for the takedown, you know, or just kind of regather ourselves. So um, it was a good combination. Yeah, I went in, you know, with the, with the jab, caught him with the right hand and then just followed up with the ground and pound. Kane's chin, because of the fight with Junior the first time and because of that Czech Congo fight, Kane Velasquez has an awesome chin. And in that second fight, I didn't think Kane would stand up with Junior, and he did, and hurt him with punches. And it's, you know, it's, this is what I'm talking about. When you talk about a trilogy between two heavyweights, this is a trilogy.